In today's reaction, we have a Patreon request from Joe Occupinti. Now we're back on Bo Burnham. I was going through Bo Burnham's songs in order, but now he's giving me a paid for request, so we have to do this one. It's called Oboe. Isn't that a musical instrument? Let's check this out. God only knows what Oboe is all about, but there's plenty of times I've watched Bo Burnham's videos and gone, Oboe. Oh, so, I wonder what topic it is, I wonder which direction he turns. Let's go. I feel like hip-hop used to be a voice for the voiceless, you know? Yeah. And now it's become, at least in the mainstream, a symbol of misogyny. <laughs> Before he carries on, this is promising to be wholesome. This is promising to be descriptive of a genre of music and now i feel like it's going to turn to something else i mean he's already mentioned misogyny <laughs> so of misogyny gay panic okay fiscal irresponsibility so i figure if you can't beat them Join them. Oh god. In the club up VIP, I got a thick mustache and a big ID. I look okay. like woolly willy with a really woolly willy. <laughs> and I bypass the bouncer, pass by an ex and I flex and bouncer. Wowzer, look at all of Bo's hoes. Looking for a ride on Bo's hoes and I spot. Oh, that is clever. Look at all of Bo's hoes. All these girls. And they all want to ride on Bo's hoes. Hoes is a name for that which we cannot say too much on. And he's also flipped the bird to this guy on the floor when he wanted some money. <laughs> okay. Okay, Bo. We see you got your fake moustache and <laughs> your fake ID. Let's go. The really woolly willy and I bypass the bouncer, pass by an ex and I flex and bouncer. Wowzer, look at all of Bo's hoes. Looking for a ride on Bo's hoes and I spot a little Latino. Booty so big, call it Oprah's ego. We go okay. do it, through it. She says, Dios me, I me, I me go. Pull it out. Stick it in your mouth and I bust in the back of ya. Swallow, bitch. There's people starving in Africa. Single. <laughs> oh, you will take it and you will swallow it and you will be thankful because there's people starving in different countries. Okay. Okay, Bo, we're going there. Oh, Bo. See, you do it every single video. It's, not, it's only 58 seconds in and I'm already saying this sort of stuff. Every single day, do it every single way. Make the single lady say, Oh, Bo. And if I were gay, though I swear I'm straight, I'd make the fellas say, You're an ice cream sundae with a cherry on top. But careful, cherry, because I'm the king of pop, 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 pop goes my weasel. Now you look like Jackson Pollock's easel. Clever. Clever. He goes pop. Pop, 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 shooting. It's also Pop Goes the Weasel. Pop Goes the Weasel as the song goes. Didn't like the nursery rhyme style song. This guy, you know, the very first one I checked out from Bo Burnham was Words, 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 and that was lyrical freaking masterpiece. And I wasn't very good at breaking down bars. I'm still not that good now, but I'm better since doing a lot of rap music. And I'm starting to hit, hear all the doubles, triples that raps, rap people do now. And uh, Bo is very, very clever with his you're an ice cream sundae with a cherry on top but careful cherry because i'm the king of pop 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 goes my weed three there just popping your cherry as well so now you look like jackson pollock's easel my suggestion is you don't blow till you know what congestion is swallow when you know what digestion is follow bo the only question is have you been splattered before by the mad hatter matador cake batter never more it don't matter whether you're spanish French, Swedish, or Cambodian. I'll slime you so hard you could be on Nickelodeon. Single. <laughs> I'll slime you so hard you could be on Nickelodeon. Everyone knows that the logo for Nickelodeon is a, like an orange splodge with Nickelodeon going through it. I did I did pick up on that bar before. I didn't want to stop it again. We was on about the king of pop, 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 pop. And then he started, he said, I started with the Michael Jackson reference. It, like after that, but I didn't want to pause it again because I heard it again. <laughs> right. I don't want to pause it every five farts. Bodie and I'll slime you so hard you could be on Nickelodeon. <laughs> single every 
single day Do it every single way Make the single lady say Oh, bo <laughs> uh, Not bowling, bow and ling Right, okay, okay, okay We've got your bow Every single way Make the single lady say Oh, bo <laughs> you for a He's having far too much fun here. <laughs> you think that you can handle me, girl, don't make me laugh. I say my junk is bipolar, it'll split you in half. Ooh. Yeah, and if you're lucky, I might just bring you home and I'll have you going down like you're growing an extra chromosome. <laughs> and when you grab me... <laughs> oh, Bo. See, he makes you say this. I love the bipolar line and split you in half because about the, the two personalities that somebody's got bipolar. Fantastic. I mean, fantastic. And he was very, very rude after that. Man, he's been rude all the way through. I'll have this, you so going matter. down like you're growing an extra chromosome. <laughs> and when you grab me, don't grab me by my buns because I got a bad case of the rust. Definitely will say oboe if you have the squits on them if they grab your bum, really. That's because you say you've got the runs. It's basically got diarrhea, hasn't it? <sighs> There's every single type of vulgarity in this song. And we love Bo Burnham for it. Nope. <laughs> I want to break it down for y'all. Uh -oh. I came from the streets with nothing. Now I'm making hit records. For my people still living in the streets, still living in poverty, I want to tell you, I'm doing this for you. My success is your Pop success. In the and I know you may be thinking, hey, if you really believe that, why don't you use some of your money to help rebuild the neighborhood instead of putting spinning rims on a gold jet ski? <laughs> that is a shot. That is not, that is a shot at people who bling their cars up, bling everything that they own up because they've got the money to. And that is a very serious message put in a sarcastic manner that some of these people who've got the riches of the music industry and whatever should actually pump some of it back into the neighborhoods if they really cared. Because when they sing about it or rap about it they don't really mean it if they're not doing anything about it look at look at Bo's face he means that he means it even though it's in a jokey way rebuild the neighborhood instead Facts. of putting spinning rims on a gold jet ski yes and to that I say uh, of course it's coming out <laughs> single every single day Do it every single way make a single It's a very catchy song, that is, actually. Uh, uh, you got a fume like a tuna. I'll smell you later. <laughs> I met a fat chick and I fucked her in an elevator. Oh, Bo, you're going too far now. Saying that people smell a tuna. Obviously not a man. Come on, Bo. And then he's done her in an elevator. Later, Let's go. I met a fat chick and I fucked her in an elevator. <laughs> it was wrong. See? Now that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. One, he's saying it's wrong to have sex in an elevator with someone who's who's big. That's what he was saying, because it's wrong on so many levels. But because it's on an elevator, it's on so many levels. Got you. I got you, Bob. Elevator. It was wrong on so many levels. It was wrong on so many levels. <laughs> so the guy it was ball. wrong on so many levels. Uh, it was wrong on. It was wrong on. It was wrong on. Single every single. Do it every single. Pop that single like a Pringle jingle. Oh, wow. Bo, the songs are most completed. All this little bitty needed instrument that's double reeded. The oboe. The instrument that's double reeded. The oboe. I did say oboe at the beginning. It's a musical instrument. 
And he's thrown it in. He couldn't not do. Come on. <laughs> I love this guy. He's so good. <laughs> He's only at one of him. In the stereotypical world of these music videos, you would have got a strike every single time, but the fact that he wants it to be imperfect um, for his comedy side of the video, and it's in one pin down, was, was absolute gold. I mean, this guy knows what, to, knows what to do, knows how to grab the audience, he knows how to um, write a freaking decent song, man. I mean, even though a lot of it's satirical and a lot of it's joking, I mean, there was a couple of real messages in there, like what I pointed out before, and the fact that he was knitting everything together to make the, the comedy and everything was just absolutely fantastic. And there really was a shot at some of the rap stars. Definitely. Wow. Oh, man, I love this guy. Absolutely love this guy. He's, uh, he's, he's, he's top drawer. You can actually... Someone told me uh, a while ago, I think it was Baz, um, that Bo Burnham said that one of his influences was Tim Minchin, and you can see that in abundance. Absolutely, see that in abundance. This was this was very very clever and very Tim Minchin like. So, anyway, what did you guys think? Let me know in the comments, and if you like my videos, then please hit like and subscribe, and I shall see you all on the next video.